Hello everyone, Robert Rambles here, and today I wanted to talk a little bit about the recent announcement for WoW Classic that some of you may have seen if you've been in your BlizzNet browser recently. WoW Classic Season of Mastery coming soon. I've taken a quick look over this, but I wanted to give it a little bit more of a deep dive with you guys, and then maybe talk about some plans uh, for the future here, depending on what we find out. So, Season of Mastery. Greetings adventurers, WoW Classic Season of Mastery is coming, giving all players a chance to start fresh and a leveling and a level playing field. This time around we're planning slightly more changes. We will launch new WoW Classic Realms for the Season of Mastery. These realms will invite new and current Classic players to begin fresh at level 1 for a complete reset of WoW Classic's content. Starting again at the very beginning of the World of Warcraft saga, what is different in the WoW Classic Season of Mastery? As with the first release of WoW Classic, we're planning six content release phases. In WoW Classic Season of Mastery, however, phase unlocks will happen faster. We're planning for a 12-month cadence with phases unlocking roughly every couple of months. Here's the current outline. So, Phase 1 will have Molten Core, Anixia, Maradon, PvP Honor System, and Battlegrounds. Phase 2, Dire Maul, Azergos, and Kazakh. Phase 3, Blackwing Lair, Darkmoon Fair. Dark Moon deck drops begin. Phase 4, Zulgarub and Green Dragons. Phase 5, Encourage War Effort and the Encourage Raid. And Phase 6, Nox and the Scourge Invasions. Raid Boss Updates. So from what I understand, that's basically the same. Nothing has changed here except that the Cadence is going to be a lot faster roughly every couple of months. Raid Boss Updates. The original release of WoW Classic was made to recreate the difficulty and challenge of the patch 1.12 from the original WoW release. While we strive to bring a faithful recreation of that release, many raid encounters turned out to be easier than the first time around. Players simply were more experienced and prepared, and patch updates greatly increased player power. With that in mind, we're planning a few changes to make those early raid bosses pack a bit more of a punch and attempt to recapture the original challenge they presented. These changes currently include, but are not limited to, world buffs, disabled in raid instances, so no more having to go get all of your world buffs before you're allowed in the raid. Restoring mechanics that were removed early on to some raid bosses. No boss debuff limit, up from 16 debuffs in WoW Classic. Increased health on bosses to offset player buffs and the removed debuff limit. Our intent with these changes is for this experience to feel somewhat more challenging than WoW Classic did in 2019. Due to the Season of Mastery's faster content release cadence, we're also planning several improvements and changes. This is probably the stuff that's going to interest me a little bit more. Faster leveling. This is great. This is one of the things that I really wanted to see uh, a change to with, with fresh servers. If I were going to be interested, it was going to need to be with faster leveling. We're planning on increasing experience gains from what they were in the first iteration of WoW Classic. Our current plan is to set them close to what the 1-60 to 60 XP rates are in the Burning Crusade Classic, with a bigger focus on quest XP increases. Okay, uh, a bigger focus on quest XP increases. So the 1 to 60 experience in Burning Crusade leveling still really seems like it's going to take somewhere around 100 hours. I could be wrong about that, uh, and I'd like for you guys to let me know who have leveled more characters through the Burning Crusade. How long does that take you in comparison to what you felt it took in the vanilla version of WoW Classic? Because... I know that it's significantly faster, but it's not really as fast as I was hoping for with, with kind of the seasonality of what they're going for here. So I don't know, we'll have to see about that. Quality of life updates. In addition, we're planning on introducing certain improvements that weren't in the original WoW Classic release, but that we think can help create a better experience. Like meeting stones converted to summoning stones, increased mining and herbalism nodes, that's interesting. Realms tend to be more densely populated in WoW Classic compared to the original 2005 design. Increasing gathering node spawns should provide a more consistent economy this time around. WoW Classic Season of Mastery will have an open beta beginning October 5th. We look forward to hearing your feedback on these changes and many others as we continue to iterate on them. Yeah, I, I really hope, uh, and I'm probably going to end up giving feedback on this as well, uh, I really hope that they iterate a little bit more uh, on some of these changes. The XP gain, it can't just be BC uh, leveling. It, it really can't. That still takes an incredible time investment, I think, for most people who are interested in playing the game. 
it's still an incredible time investment. They need to crank it up. Uh, I, I would even go so far as to say, I, I wanna see the one to 60 be somewhat closer to retail. If they're gonna go with seasons, uh, which it seems like that's what they're doing, right? Season of Mastery coming soon. And I, I'm assuming that we're gonna be, you know, every couple of months. So if we're planning for a 12 month cadence, yeah, I guess that's a year. I just don't really, I just don't know if that is going to interest me as, as much. I would have preferred for a six, six month seasonal cadence with much faster leveling. And I'm kind of interested if I'm the only person in that boat or if more of you guys feel the same way. Like if I want to do seasonal WoW Classic, I, I don't really want that to drag out for a year. Uh, I'd love to get it on maybe a six or a nine month rotation and have the leveling process be faster. And then I wanna see more changes to the raid bosses, maybe some things like adding in raids, maybe even pulling content from other expansions uh, beyond classic, beyond vanilla at least, or creating entirely new raid encounters or new bosses within the existing raids would be a really cool idea. Uh, but yeah, I would really like to see a lot more. I really like that they're getting rid of world buffs in raid instances. I think that's great for players. Restoring mechanics that were removed early, uh, that could be interesting. And then the debuff limit is also great for players. Increase on health, just seems like you're if you're just going to give the boss more health, that's just going to take more time. I don't know if that adds a lot of interest to the actual encounters, just that it's going to take more time to kill the bosses. Uh, quality of life updates, there's obviously like so much more they can do here and it seems like they plan to keep iterating on this, but the fact that they chose to release this announcement uh, with these things, it makes me wonder on how many more big changes they're actually planning. I mean, they did say hashtag some changes, or was it slightly more changes? I just want to see hashtag, hashtag changes and just have a lot of changes. Um, but yeah, it, it's really interesting. I, I am interested. I, I'm not going to beta test it. <laughs> That's not going to happen. Uh, but I might want to check out a fresh server when this does go live. If I see a few more changes, I, I really want this to be a little bit faster. Close to what? When you say close to what, that like kind of makes me feel like it's not even going to be as fast. I don't know what it means by a bigger focus on quest XP increases. Is that so? Is that saying like that's how you're gonna make it faster? Is just by increasing the quest experience, not kill experience? I guess that could be how how to take that one. But for quality of life, there's there's so many more things they could do here, and so I, I really want to see this list grow a lot more to really reel me in and keep me there, and I want to see this be a little bit quicker. Uh, a, a year-long season? I mean, it, it's kind of a long season, right? It's kind of a long time. Uh, maybe a nine-month season? I'm not really sure how Diablo 3 did its seasons. I, I don't know what cadence they used, but I, I don't think it was a full year. Uh, it could have been. But yeah, I'm interested to know, what do you guys think about this? Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear your thoughts on other things that they could change, things you'd want to see added to a classic plus experience, to a fresh start. And does any of this interest you guys? Are you going to want to roll a new character on a fresh server? Let me know what you think below. I really want to hear from you. And until then, take care of yourselves out there and take care of each other. And we will see you in Azeroth sometime really soon. Bye now.